I'll be sharing with you is actually how to uh, turn your uh, personal account, you know, this is my personal uh, YouTube account. So as you can see, how do you know this is a personal or branded account? By actually going to a YouTube studio. And then from YouTube studio, you um, uh, to the left side here, go click on settings uh, to see if this is a personal uh, or a branded. Okay, so how do you find out? So click on permissions, and then that's how you see it. This is actually not branded. It's a personal uh, personal uh, YouTube channel. How can we turn this personal uh, YouTube channel into a branded channel? So this is what I'm going to show you in this video, okay? So it's going to be a few steps, very simple steps, actually a couple of clicks, but not inside here, okay? But let me show you also how the branded channel looks like. The branded channel looks like this. I have another channel. Let me switch to that channel right now. It's just, I have so many channels, but I'm just going to take you to a branded one. So this one is one of the brand, uh, branded channels I, ha I have. It's in a, in a different language. Okay. Uh, I'm going to click on settings and I'm going to click on permission. And you see the difference here. Keep managing permission if you are brand account. This is a branded channel. The other one wasn't. And what's the difference? Well, a huge difference, actually, if you want to sell the channel later, later on, if you want to change roles, if you want to manage your roles, it's, it's, it's totally different, you know, and I, I highly recommend that you have a branded channel uh, instead of a personal channel. So this is what this video is all about. So we're going to do actually that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move on. and I'm going to go back to actually the uh, other channel. So I'm going to switch account and go to... Uh, <clears throat> Uh, this channel here, which Adam, it's Adam Chamsin. And as I said, this channel is not branded. It's actually, um, a personal channel. So I want to, I wanted to brand this channel. So what do I do instead? First thing first, we are going to, um, uh, go to, um, channel. I think we can do it from here. Yeah, so this is my channel, right? This is not a branded channel. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to uh, to get to settings. So settings, you get to settings by clicking on your profile and make sure you are in the in in the right channel, which is I am, all right? And I'm going to click on settings here. And from here, uh, I want to actually go click on add or manage your channels. Okay, so I'm going to click on add or manage channels uh, and then uh, I'm going to be prompted to this. Okay, so this is my channel, right? And then I'm gonna go ahead and create actually a channel. I'm gonna create, okay, actually this is how you do it. So you create a channel and then you add the channel name. So I'm gonna go and uh, have exactly the same, actually. And then I'm gonna click on understand and I'm gonna click create. Okay, now I'm still in the same, under the same Google account, same, you know, uh, and then now it's actually created me a channel here. It says this channel does not exist. Okay, it doesn't have anything. It's empty right now. Okay, but this is the uh, this is the new channel, right? So now if I go back and I switch, click on switch account, you can see now. Uh, sorry, uh, I have too many things open here. As you can see here, Adam Chamsin, and now I have a new channel that also with the same name, Adam Chamsin, with the E by the, at the end. So that is a branded channel now. Now, how do I know this is a branded channel? Let, let's check it out. Okay. See if this is a branded channel. This is empty. See, this channel is totally empty right now. If I go to YouTube Studio, and then if I click continue here, it's fine. Close it. And then I'm going to click on settings. And you can see that if you click on permission, this is a branded channel. You can tell from here. So you can tell from here that, um, uh, this is a branded channel now. Okay, cool. So now we have that. So let's go back and um, click on switch account. Go back to the previous one, which I have 80 subscribers on that one. Okay. So, and then from here, I want to go to settings now. And I am going to uh, view advanced settings, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and you can see here under advanced settings, something called move channel or delete channel. Now, what I want to do with this channel, actually, I want to move it. So I'm going to click on move it. 
I'm gonna move it to a brand channel. Now it's gonna ask you to log in to verify it's you. So I'm gonna log in here and then let me verify. I'm gonna grab my cell phone here because I have to verify from my cell phone. And then I'm gonna click on verification here. And I have the number on the screen. So I'm gonna say, yeah, it's me. So do that. And um, right now I am in, in here. Okay, cool. So now when, once I'm in, uh, please re rewind this video if you missed it. So uh, we're going to be under advanced settings. So we are we are under advanced settings in the in this channel, which is not branded. I'm going to move it to a branded channel. This is the reason why I created Adam Chamsin here, which is the one here. You see, it says here already has a YouTube channel. Okay, cool. So uh, now uh, we are going to move this one over to this one. All right, and it's going to happen magically, actually, hopefully. So, uh, replace. So, I'm going to click on replace because we're going to do this one. This is the one that we created. Okay. Uh, we're going to replace. And then it's going to ask you, okay, delete this channel. Here is a channel that will be deleted by moving your channel. You will be permanently deleted. So, don't worry. I'm going to click on understand. I'm going to say, okay, <laughs> click on delete. <laughs> so, I'm going to delete that. And then underneath here, it says move channel. All right. So, move channel. And that's it. Wow. What now? Let's wait uh, just a few seconds here to ab absorb what we just did. Actually, we just deleted everything I had on the channel. The subscribers, all the videos, everything. I moved it to another channel. And let's go check if this happens in instantly or not. So uh, I'm going to go back here. Uh, of course, you know, so this People can make mistakes when they do this and they lose everything. Imagine losing everything. Let me check now uh, on uh, that by switch account. And this is the channel I have. So this is my channel. See here. I'm going to click on your channel. So this is, okay, so this is all the videos. I have on this channel, this is all about crypto. All right. So uh, let me check on that channel now. So YouTube Studio, I'm going to go to settings to see what happens. Welcome to YouTube Studio. Continue. Okay, cool. So I'm going to click on settings and permissions and voila. All right. See, now that uh, everything has moved Everything has been converted to a brand channel right now. Okay, as you can see, and I can see it from here. All right. So everything has been converted to this channel. Everything has stayed the same. My brand, all the videos, all the contents, everything here you can see it's everything still the same. The only thing that has changed that this channel has been converted right now to actually a branded channel instead of a personal channel. That's it. So that's how you uh, uh, that's how you actually uh, convert a personal channel to a brand channel. Very simple. Just create, you know, like I showed you in the beginning, create a channel empty, totally, and then go ahead and switch the, to the original channel and move it over to the new channel. I hope this was easy, not confusing. Rewind the video if you have to. Thank you so much for watching.